Hey there, this is James Darknell from The Foundry with another Moto 10 series quick clip. In this video I'm going to be showing you the Unity Material Importer script that we've created for Moto Series 10. Uh, so you can see here's my Substance Painter asset here that I have. And I've set this one up for Unity, so the indicator to the export engine uh, that a specific surface needs to be exported out is having the correct Unity or Unreal material within the material group. Uh, and then I have all of the texture set with the appropriate effect on here. So now that my asset is prepared and ready to be exported, uh, I am in the Games tool layout and I'm under my Export tab here. Uh, and within here you could define a number of presets. So I'm going to select my Unity preset and I'm going to copy my textures. You want to just make sure that the textures are going to be in the right location. Uh, and then have a relative export path. So you want to make sure that those textures are saved relative to the file save location that you've indicated up here. So with those settings set, I'm not going to change anything else outside of default. I'm just going to press export. And it should only take a second to do that. So we can look here really quick. What's happened, it's created the textures folder. Let's put all of my textures inside of the folder. Uh, and then it's created an FBX file and this XML file. So we'll be importing these assets into Unity now that they've been created. So we just switch over to Unity here really quick. So when you first start up Unity and create a project, you're going to get this basic blank scene. So I'm just going to show you how to get started in using the script. So in your assets folder, you're going to want to create, right click on here and get create folder. And we're going to want to name this folder editor. Make sure we spell that correct. So I'm going to go into editor folder and I'm going to import a new asset. So when you imp when you get Moto 10, you're going to get this script called Moto Material Importer.cs. So you're going to want to locate the position of that and then import that. And when it imports, you'll get this little C sharp icon inside of your editor folder. So we're going to jump back out of assets. Now that we've added that script in there, this is going to allow us to import our Moto materials. So the next thing I'm going to do is import a new asset, go into the Unity folder, and first I'm going to import the FBX file, which is the geometry of that file. So you can see if I drag that into the scene here and frame that, that it doesn't have any textures on it. So the next thing that we're going to want to do is we're going to also want to import another new asset, and we're going to import this XML file. This will take a few seconds to go through the process of importing all of those textures. Alright, so now you can see that our object does indeed have its textures on here. I'm going to take that and move it up a little bit. So in order to see the textures obviously in Unity, we're going to need to add a light over here. So I'm going to right click on that and I'm just going to add in a directional light and try and move that and we can see here that that is rotated the wrong way so I gotta get the light so now you can see our textures are working as expected we can change the intensity on that light a little bit so that is how you get the moto materials imported into unity thanks for watching